Dr. Lee, this morning you presented the uh, Sutro lec Memorial Lecture, and you outlined many of the opportunities and challenges facing uh, uh, the, the field of glaucoma in terms of innovation. Could you highlight some of those uh, innovate, uh, those challenges and opportunities? It was a wonderful opportunity to talk about some of the larger factors that are in play for all of us for glaucoma care, for eye care, for health care in general. We all know that there is a growing number of individuals who are getting older and all of the chronic eye diseases, particularly glaucoma, grow both in incidence and prevalence as people get older. So there's going to be a very large market of folks. There's a changing demographics, so we'll have more Hispanics who have a significantly higher rate of glaucoma than in the white population. We'll also have associated issues with the cost of care, how we integrate new technology, and how the workforce that we have is able to deliver the care. We certainly don't have enough eye care providers to continue to do care the way we've typically done it. And so this is an opportunity for us to take advantage of all of these changes and create new models that work better for our patients. Okay. Now, when you're in, in implementing innovation in care, uh, you, met, you talked about that as well. How important is that for the clinician you know, in, in, in this clinic? The importance of implementation into care is essential. It's as the business people say, it's the last mile problem. We have these terrific new products. We have these terrific scientific discoveries that Glaucoma Research Foundation and others support that will allow us to diagnose glaucoma earlier, to have a better understanding in the prevention and potential reversal of nerve damage from glaucoma. And so people can see we have different ways of monitoring how glaucoma works. Yet all of these inventions and discoveries, if they're not applied to the care of a patient wherever they may be, it's as if that invention was never ever discovered as far as that patient's concerned. So being able to foster ways of increasing the odds that a particular patient will be able to take advantage of new discoveries is really critical. So what would be your take home message for the, the, the Sutro lecture? The take-home lecture is that there are lots of great opportunities there. We're fortunate to be in a place at a time where there are some amazing discoveries that we could use to really help our patients with glaucoma keep their eyesight. It really is an exciting time. And so it's incumbent upon us to be able to help create some ways for people to be able to take advantage of these and to help people take more charge of their own lives so that they can monitor their condition that detect glaucoma earlier and without making it dependent upon having to come in to see the doctor all the time. Thank you, Dr. Lee.